this video, I will be showing you how to put more than one effect on text in Canva. For example, you can see that I've added a text box right here. Now, to put more than one effects, there are numerous ways you can do this. The first option is, after selecting the text box, you could tap on effects from the top right hand corner of the navigation bar, and then from there, you can select an effect that you would like to add. So let's say for example, I would like to add the splice effect. I could select that. Then after selecting the splice effect, you could scroll down. And if you would like it to be curved, you can do that. So that is an option to add more than one effect. Another option that I would recommend you give a try is all you'll need to do after selecting your text box, you'll tap on duplicate. So after you have duplicated it, what I would recommend you do is select the first text box. And let's say, for example, I would like it to be hollow, the hollow effect. I would select the hollow effect, as you can see right there. And then let's say, for example, the next text option, I want it to be the neon or the glitch. So let's say the neon. So you can see it right there. Now, all you'll need to do is simply drag and place them on top of each other, and you can see how it looks right there. And if I, it is a case that I wanted to add more than one effect, so let's say, for example, three different effects, all I would need to do, I'm going to tap on none right there, and I would simply copy again, and then I would have three boxes. So let's say I'm going to be using the neon effect for this one, so you can see right there, I've placed it. Then for this one, you can choose something else. So let's say, for example, the glitch effect or the splice effect, any one of these effects that you would like to use, you can select it right there. After you have done that, all you'll need to do is simply drag and place the effect, as you can see right there. And you can see this has now you this has, this is using three different effects, as you can see right there. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.